So the other day I started looking at my Facebook friend list and I was looking through Facebook and I, while I enjoy having hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of friends, I just don't know all these people that well. Like, like who's Trey Sharp or Miley Wittgenstein? You know, I just feel like alienated and you know, like this, this is kind of like not the way it should go. I'm not that close to you and, and you're not calling me on the phone to tell me stuff. So I don't really feel like they're there as my friend. So my husband said, well, if you feel that way, why don't you just delete them? Delete them? Yeah. My friend Joe did it. Just like, you know, just like go crazed Facebook friend purge. That's what he called friend it. Friend purge. Yeah, just do the friend purge. It's fun. It's very cathartic, I think. I was like, all right. So I started going on Facebook and I started deleting the friends, you know, one by one. Pew, pew, pew. You know, like asteroids. And, you know, I felt really good and exhilarating. I was really happy. I was like, oh, they're all going. But, you know, afterwards I started having this stomach ache. I don't feel good. Why? What's wrong? It's my stomach. What? I don't feel good. What? Wait, what, what, I have a belly. You... I have a belly full of bad karma. So I decided, you know, to call some of these people back. I thought, you know, maybe they'll take me back. <sighs> Hi, Jessica. It's me, Stephanie Scott. Look, I know it's been a while, and I've done something terribly, terribly stupid. I accidentally deleted you from my Facebook page. I was ever so stupid. So if you wouldn't mind like going into Facebook and then adding me back in, I'd really appreciate it. Thank you. Jessica? Hi, it, it, it's me again. I mean, what I actually meant to say was, okay, it wasn't entirely an accident. I, I just had, well, you know, that you and I weren't really talking all that much, and I just kind of thought you'd forgotten me, so I decided that it was okay to skim a little off the froth a little bit, you know what I mean? No, wait, that didn't come out right. I mean, not, you're not the froth, okay? You're not the froth. Anyway, damn it, damn, it just turned off. Can I, can I try this again? I, I, I want to call her back. Hi, Jessica. What I meant to say was that I really like being friends with you on Facebook. Except that, well, I've tried to play zombie attack with you several times, and it must have bit you five times when you don't bite back, and I'm just sitting there, I'm just feel, sitting there feeling kind of stupid. So then I hit you with my fluffy Angora pillow, and you didn't do anything. I mean, we both got college degrees, and I don't even know why I played zombie attack with you at all, you know? I mean, you're a doctor. You're a medical doctor. You don't have time for that shit. So it's my fault, okay? You know, you friended me. You friended me. And so, of course, like naturally, I thought it was okay for me to give you my phone number. I didn't think I was breaking some like stupid etiquette rule that like, you know, everyone's supposed to be passive aggressive sitting behind their computers on Facebook. La, 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 la. You know, I'm passive aggressive. Ooh. You know, why would I want to join the Tony Braxton fan club on Facebook? I don't like her. I don't listen to her. My husband told me that she broke up the Dallas Mavericks. I don't want to be friends with someone like that. And there was one that was like, Obama is the Antichrist. What do I want to join that page for? I'm Jewish. I mean, Diane Sawyer would have figured that out by now. Flair. Well, it's pretty simple to figure out. I mean, he'd be walking around with like a 666 on his forehead. Don't you know what I'm talking about? Mm. Come on, do it. Do another. Stop that. No, it's funny. Come on. It's like they're dying. Come on. I want to call Miley. No, what? Honey, you don't have to. Miley Cyrus doesn't give a shit about you. Oh, Every time I log onto my page, I see that whole list of the people who I may know, and it's the guy, the very first guy who ever felt me up. Like, well, I don't want to see him. It's nice that I see all these new photos from your Halloween party. I'm not there. Am I supposed to share in the laughter? I'm sorry, but the pictures are not recreating the experience for me. Hi, is this the Facebook tech support? Hi, you know, I have a problem. I got drunk and I deleted 500 of my friends. Is there any way I could get them back? Jessica? Stephanie, it's me. Never fucking call me ever again.